what? He has been one of the best players for this team so far early in this season as they've continued to try to find their way, but the rookie kind of... All right, lots of wild happenings on the ice tonight. Let's take a look at some of the scores and what went down. The Ducks were hoping to quiet the crowd on the road against the Blues. St. Louis powerful in their own end, giving up really not much of anything on the way to the shutout victory. Hi, everybody, along with Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabolski. Welcome to Toronto. The Leafs will get a chance to enjoy some home cooking for an extended period, Ray. Always good to get home to play some games in a row where you can build a routine again. Once you start bouncing around, it really gets difficult as the games pile up and you don't get any rest. Battle along the boards. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. And another stop. To the low slot. He gets that one, too. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. The Kings get a hold of the puck along the boards. Slides the pass over to King. Taken along the wall by Hoffman. Pokes it away in his own end. With the stop. Hard hit on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. Lots of time left in this period. We've still got zeros on the board. Slides it across to Dodanov. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. Moves it around along the half wall. Puck picked up by Larson. Nice poke check. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Loses his balance on the play. Snaps it on net, just wide of the net. Oh, he worked hard to generate that shot. He just misses wide. Feeds the puck to Soderberg. Sends the pass over. Shaves the puck away. The Kings scoop it up along the boards. Puck grabbed by Larson. And here's the pass to King. They've got numbers. He got all of that one. Moves with the puck in the corner. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Moves it to Kerfoot. Puts it in deep. The Kings have it against the wall. Solid hit on that play. Slides the paddle in there and pokes it away. Good use of the body on the play. And he takes a shot, and he comes up with it. And now he moves it quickly to Hoffman. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. He scores! Double D doubles down to light the lamp. Drew Doughty. Now they're going to look at this on video and not be very happy with it. They turned the puck over, and now the odd man rush develops. They can't get back to stop it. L.A. has still got a deep hole to climb out of, but they do have something here to build on. A positive step. Something goes their way after playing very poorly in the first half of this period. Toronto's offense has been shining brightly so far in this first period. L.A.'s got it, and they're on the attack. Couldn't connect on that pass. L.A.'s got the puck in the defensive end. Here's a short pass to Johansson. L.A.'s on the attack. That pass doesn't go. Here's a chance to get it out. And he's able to move the puck across the blue line and out of harm's way. L.A.'s got a hold of it along the wall. Here they come. Quick pass to Johansson. L.A.'s got it along the wall. Paddled away by Anderson. Both sides back to even strength. A great effort by the penalty killers there. Oh, when the puck moves and the feet don't, this is what you get. You have lots of zone time, but no real dangerous chances on that power play. Toronto's moving it along the wing. Throws it in. LA's got a hold of it against the wall. Slides the puck over. 
into the offensive zone. Last minute of play. Inside the final minute of the first here. Gains the zone from the right side. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Los Angeles has it near the wall. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. The Leafs going to work on offense. Winds up from the point, and that shot gets caught in traffic. The first period in the books, and not a moment too soon. What a performance, at least at one end. And we're about set to drop the puck here on period number two. LA's won the draw. Moves it quickly over to King. Dishes it to Kopitar. Big play inside the defensive zone. Dishes it to Dodanov. Now a quick pass to Matthews. Nice zone entry on the left side. The Leafs take it along the wall. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. LA's gained possession along the boards. Quick feed to King. They've got the defense outnumbered. Gets a glove on it to make the save. Anderson's comfortable back in the net. He's got a big lead and he hasn't had many shots to deal with. Back between the benches we go. Ray Ferraro is standing by where it looks like there's a lot of activity going on around you. Yeah, they need something to happen here, James. And the coach has gone right to his youngest player, the rookie, to remind him that they need more. They need more energy. They need more spark with the puck. They want him to be creative. But it's got to be everybody. Kopitar's one of their only hopes to get back in the game. Their deficit is so large. They're going to need a lot to go right. Moves Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Let's it go. Gets in front of it. Play blown dead. Penalty coming up here. The Kings have been handed a minor penalty for high sticking. Guys are always sour when they get called for a high sticking penalty, but when you look at it, your stick is up above your own shoulders. It's no good there. Pretty clear. And the power play unit takes to the ice their first chance to try to make something happen in this game. 56 seconds. Slides it quickly to Dodanov. Up along the wing. Los Angeles gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Now over to Kopitar. All smart heads up play to poke that one away. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. Looks to make a play over to Larson. From the point, looks to make something happen. And he denied that opportunity. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Too much to not enough. It's 5-1. Los Angeles will go to work here in the offensive end. And that's blocked. The Leafs will play it in their own end. Tries to get it over to Matthews. Cuts to the paint. He scores! They didn't sit back after getting that first one. They pile a back-to-back -back goal on here. The Leafs are really starting to turn this thing on in a second. They seem a half a step quicker all over the ice. That adds up into a lead that they can extend. Set it out in front. Can't connect. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Time of the goal. Toronto's dominated right from the start. Their offense clicking on all cylinders, and they lead here in the second. And now it's grabbed by Walker. Gives them nothing in front. The setters will glide into the dot. Los Angeles wins the draw. Hoffman's got it against the boards. Oh, what a slick stop by Anderson. Passes over to Soderberg. Tosses it to Hole. Nice zone entry from the middle. And it's a quick pass to Kerfoot. He got all of that hit. The Kings are in transition. Receives the pass. And that's stopped by Anderson. The Leafs have to be feeling good about themselves here in the late stages of this second period as they continue to lead big. 
back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. A shot, and he makes the save. The Leafs take possession off the faceoff. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Sends a pass over. Denies him in front. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. Less than a minute to go here in the second. Los Angeles has possession of it now. Here's a short pass to Kopitar. The Kings played along the wing. And that one's broken up. Quick pass to Dodanov. Good hit to pump him off the puck. There's the horn ending period number two. I'm not sure they wanted it to end. 40 minutes in the books. Big third period coming up for both teams, and we're ready to go. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third. Let's see if anything changes. Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? Los Angeles is going to have to be much more selective where they play the puck. They've given it to the opponent time after time after time in the first two periods. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Here's an odd man rush to his teammate, and he scores. Geez, I like this, James. When the puck's in their hands, they attack, and they attack in layers. The odd man rush is worked to perfection. Ray Ferraro back between the benches, and the kid has looked all right tonight, hasn't he? Oh, I think better than that, James. I mean, he had an instruction early from his coach about the way they wanted him to play. Remember, we checked in on that. Well, now he's getting the tap on the shoulder because he's done the job the coach hoped he could do. L.A. is back at center ice. They have a long way to go still here, though, Ray. Yeah, get your scores out there, James. Don't worry about the defensive end of the ice. You need goals. The Kings get a hold of the puck off the draw. Dowdy's going to play it against the half wall. Moves it quickly over to King. And they'll be forced to regroup as the puck escapes the offensive end. Taken by Larson. Feeds it to Kopitar. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. Takes a shot. Oh, what a stop. Los Angeles has it behind the net. The Kings move the puck in the defensive zone. And now it's over to King. And sends it just out of reach. Lifts the stick and takes the puck. The Leafs have it now. And he slides it quickly to Soderberg. Here they come on the attack. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Here he is in front. Oh, and that goes wide. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. Stars and Leafs Nation is rocking. Toronto's goal-scoring abilities have been on full display so far this evening and here in the third. Really impressive display. They've moved the puck well, skated, really forecheck. Well, there's really nothing they haven't done tonight. Quick feed to Philpola. L.A. is looking to break out of their own end. And he slides it quickly to Hoffman. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Scooped up along the wall by Kopitar. Denies him with the blocker. What a stop by Anderson. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. X 
excellent stick work on the play. Stopped by the goaltender. Anderson's under fire, and he's going to hang on for the whistle. Sometimes you freeze it to give your teammates a breather. Sometimes you freeze it so you get yourself one. He's been really busy tonight, but he's been exceptionally sharp. It is all over. The Kings had their opportunities to win this one, but came up short. Did a lot of little things right, and I guess the coaches can emphasize that going forward, but not enough offense. They didn't have enough of the puck. All right, let's get all you poolies and all you hockey fans caught up on all the action out on the ice tonight. The Kings took to the ice for a collision with the Maple Leafs. Toronto tore it up on this night, and they pick up the two points. They may not have won this one, but their sensational freshman continues to impress finding the back of the net. Let's take a look at the rest of the schedule in the NHL. The Wild played on the road against the Predators. Minnesota posts a win in a close one. The Wings had a tall order to fill as they tried to take two on the road against the Canadians. Detroit topples the opposition with a strong defensive performance, and they get the win. Don't go anywhere. We've got much more here on the show.